Hey, what's going on, guys? And welcome into your Pig Trail Nation report. I'm CJ Macklin. Beside, I'm sitting beside the second year head coach, Monday Patel. How you doing today, man? I'm doing well. How are you doing? I'm pretty good. I'm pretty third and final day for you guys. You guys are wrapped up to everything. You got professionals coming in from different parts of the country. How tough is it to have three practices with all these guys coming from different parts of the country and, you know, having different things that, that they do and they like doing and just have to mesh in three days? It's tough to do. Uh, some, I mean, most of it's fun, mainly because these guys are professionals and they all play a certain type of way so I mean you got guys like Sonny who are big leaders and you got guys like Barford who are big leaders you see them leading right now here honestly just them them coming in them playing professional ball they know how to play basketball so you don't have to teach the very basics you just have to talk about terminology and what uh, your goals are in in playing so how are you guarding ball screen what are you doing offensively what are you doing on base on out of bounds those are the biggest things and all these guys are played pro and played basketball for most of their life, so it makes it easy. Honestly, just them them coming in, them playing professional ball, they know how to play basketball, so you don't have to teach the very basics. You just have to talk about terminology and what uh, your goals are in, in playing. So how are you guarding ball screens? What are you doing offensively? What are you doing on base on out of bounds? Those are the biggest things, and all these guys have played pro and played basketball for most of their life, so it makes it easy. Yeah, for million dollar focus, million dollar everything. Yeah, yeah. Three, three. One, two, three. Team Arkansas. Now talk about your team. We talked about the basketball team. Talk about your team, coaching staff. You got your assistant coaches, you got your player development coaches. How how much have they helped you uh, throughout this process? Man, without them, I wouldn't be anywhere. Um, Coach Witters at UCA, uh, Coach Vance at Arkansas State, Coach Yates at Harding, um, Coach Bandy that's now at West Memphis Christian. All of those guys have such a past record of just success. So why wouldn't I take their advice? Why wouldn't I lean on them? That's what uh, I've been taught by so many of the coaches I've worked for. Good coaches lean on their assistant coaches. You're going to post those. We're going to try to get it to you. Oh, I talk about uh, some of your returning players, like Jalen Barford. Sonny was talking about him as well, and yeah, how he wasn't scoring like he is this year. Like he got, you know, a little bit more scoring to him this year, and especially in practice. I mean, he was heating up. JB, <laughs> a big kid. He's so funny, so energetic. <laughs> I mean, I, I swear, he's 16 years old in a 25-year-old's body. He's the most trash-talking guy for all in the league. He doesn't stop talking. He's so funny. But, I mean, JB, his scoring ability is great. He's got one of the best finishing packages I've ever seen in my life. Um, he's got a lot of dog to him. He's got a good, really, really good TBT career when he took the underdogs. I think they, won, I think they made it to the third round game just off his back as a low 15 seed. So us being able to out, add a power like him and then even add guys like a, like a Jimmy Witt onto the team just makes us you know, more versatile. Coach, I appreciate your time, man. You know, I appreciate these last three days. It's been a, it's been a pleasure. Hey, I appreciate y'all having me. I appreciate you coming. You guys, go win that thing now. Bring back, so. bring back a little couple dollars. I'll Trust take a couple dollars. I don't forget. I don't forget who helped. I never forget who helped. <laughs> That's it for your picture. Nice report, everybody. We'll see you guys after the break.